take three for this one. Today we have, you can't even see the top of it, but we'll back it up a little bit, a very gorgeous wine decanter. And this one is, as you can see, very unique and pretty. It is 100% lead free hand blown for wine. It holds 1800 milliliters. It's a great gift for any wine lovers in your family. It came nicely packed in styrofoam that I'll show you at the end when I go to pack it back up. But they basically have the hand blown lead free glass that will not only impress but your, the wine, but your guests as well. It's perfect for any event especially for anybody that enjoys wine. It has free cleaning beads. Their custom cleaning beads are especially designed to remove wine stains from the wonderful item. These are the beads. They come in a nice little container. They're supposed to be used to remove any stains they might have. It's supposed to help you because you can't really scrub it. You might end up scratching the surface comes with a nice little card right here as you can see nice little card I'm trying to oh I flash coming from my phone not the background okay you have a nice little card here it tells you the care instructions are washed by hand with cold or warm soapy water it is not microwave or dishwasher safe and they say that they make efforts to provide new products and look forward to your continuing support how nice of them in a nice little card i like the cards don't mind me all right so the best thing about this that i would say is even though i don't drink i know there's it's hard sometimes to pour out of wine bottles so pretend i'm putting a wine bottle and putting some in the bottom even though it's just water it gives you a general idea for one can you see the nice little reflection it gives on the surface that's pretty you can't really see that though but it looks pretty it's very well made seems pretty solid nice soft edges just making sure all right and I've already looked for a wine glass which I do not have one but shocker of all shockers I don't drink but I have a full collection of shot glasses so I can show you how easily it pours out of this for wine. It'd be great for guests over because it doesn't spill as easily. You can pour it out more controlled. Instead of pouring out of a wine bottle, it's much simpler. Just the little end of this right there. It's like a little spigot. And I poured a little too much last time, so I'm being a little careful. You can pour it in there very gently and very slowly as in comparison to the other side which you can't really control and ends up spilling on the counter so in general you can see it's much easier to pour wine out of something like this if you are a wine drinker like i said i am not so i just i thought it was pretty maybe put water beads and something in it make it a nice decoration i got water beads too that might be a good idea I can put it different color water beads on different levels so it looks all pretty. I still have to test the water beads. The ones that are over there. Yeah. That'd be pretty. Just use it for decoration. What using that? The decanter. I don't drink wine. I just got it was pretty. Well, yeah, but if you put water beads in it, I can't ever nobody can ever drink alcohol out of it. Who's gonna drink alcohol out of it anyway? There are plenty of different options. It's like a piece of art. All right, so I don't care. So we have the styrofoam container it came in, nicely packed, nice and shaped perfectly. So it's super easy to put it back in there for for storing it, because that's what I'm going to do in just a moment. Just put it back in gently, the right direction first, which is kind of important it fits in perfect because the other side has the slant that will hold everything in place the beads go in the middle so just to make sure you can see all this we have 
Did you get it right there? With the beads in the middle. And I kept the other end taped so it could just close back up perfectly. Perfectly, I thought. What is not going smoothly? Huh. Supposed to go in perfectly. I don't know why it wouldn't. Unless it doesn't fit that way. Yeah, I don't write a script, guys. Sorry about that. Probably should learn my lesson at some point to write a script instead of looking like an idiot. But what would be the fun in that? So it looks like it should sit perfectly like that, but I don't know. Maybe this part up here first. Because that's. Ah, there we go. That was the problem. Now it fits. See? It's the bead holder inside of it that was having a problem. So as you can see, nice container to store it when you're not using it. Who knows? Maybe I will use it with water beads when I go to show them to you. Who knows with me? I'm still trying to figure out exactly how to do that. So that is the wine decanter. Beautiful piece of art. Beautiful, different, unique. Never seen anything like it before. Well made and pretty. I like pretty things. So I'm trying to make sure I covered everything. I did this video once and had a creature jump up in the middle of it. If you like the decanter, there is a link below to purchase it, as usual. I always make sure the link is included. And the item seems solid. If you have not subscribed to my channel yet, please do, because I review random items at random times. Got plenty of items to review, just get into them one by one. And look, my nails are purple today. Just in case, this one is pure ice. See? Pure ice. It's a little late, sorry. And this color is, he's my squeeze. That's interesting. Nice name. There you go. Don't remember how much I paid for it, but need to say if you're interested in the color, because everyone asks, I figured I'd share it with you. So, with that, I hope everybody has an enjoyable day or evening, depending on what time they're watching this. And I am going to go do some shopping on Amazon to find new things to show you, besides what I already have. Thank you, and have a wonderful whatever time of the day it is. Bye.